What's going on guys, it's Hanno Player here and today what I'm going to show you is how you can improve your aim in Call of Duty or any FPS game for that matter, COD, Battlefield, Halo, you name it. And uh, the answer to this question is Control Freaks. Now I'll say first off, this is not a paid or sponsored promotion, nobody is paying me anything to say this. I'm a Control Freak affiliate which means that uh, it's not the same thing as being sponsored and I just work with them but I do not get paid and I can honestly say they don't pay me anything in money or products to uh, say good things about them. They, uh, they did send me some products to review, which means that basically they're that confident in their products that they know that if they send me some free products, then uh, I'll have nothing but good things to say about them. And uh, that's basically true. So they sent me some products over a month ago, and uh, I've waited this long because I've been using them for a month, and I've been getting used to them, and I wanted to see if they were truly good. I didn't want to just make a video like a day after having them and be like, oh yeah, they're awesome, they're great, definitely go get them, because that wouldn't be honest, and that would be me telling you my honest uh, review of them. So I'm going to tell you a little bit about them, and uh, basically how they can improve your aim which is what we want to achieve right here and uh, these are basically some little things that you add onto your controller and uh, they are extensions to the actual thumbsticks or analog sticks which gives you more leverage so you can actually move them so basically because the actual thumbsticks are bigger you have to exert less force on them to be able to move them so that means they're easier to move and so because you're aiming with the right thumbstick then you're aiming with the right thumbstick is going to be a lot more fluid and easier to get your shots on target when you're playing these kind of games and there's uh, so these things I would recommend for people who play on sensitivity over 4 or anything around the medium sensitivity in your shooting games and they'll basically help you get your shots on target and they're especially good if you're quick scoping or sniping because they're, they're, they're great for everyone but even even better for sniping because sniping is obviously more important about getting that one very precious uh, shot on target and not missing it so if you're quick scoping or sniping these things are drastically going to improve your aim and uh, so these things are basically these little plastic add-ons that will click onto the controller there's no glue or DIY involved and uh, they also help your grip in uh, in addition to helping the actual movement of the analog stick or the thumbstick they will actually help the grip because uh, if you see the surface of these FPS freaks they're actually kind of a uh, they're grooved or they're shaped in very different ways that help you uh, keep your grip with your thumbs on the thumbsticks and so if your uh, if your thumbs or hands get very sweaty when you normally play then uh, this will help improve your aim and this is all going towards improving your accuracy when you're playing these FPS games now this has actually been a part of the community for many many years there's nothing new and uh, you'll find all the big YouTubers and pro players in the community actually use these control freaks and uh, work with them because they are honestly good products and uh, you can find CNANAs in like 2010 talking about them so they're a very popular thing they like scuff controllers and everyone kind of knows that they're a very very good uh, product to be able to help improve your game and these things unlike some other products out there are very 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 cheap and they're very simple everyone can use them and uh, they work with of course PS3 and Xbox controllers and also I believe any other controller that's ever been made uh, nearly that has the same same kind of analog sticks but uh, they work with nearly every console that you're going to want to use and uh, I have them on both of my controllers you can see these pics right here these are actually my controllers and how I have mine set up uh, you can actually see I have the larger uh, control freak on the uh, on the right stick because that's the one that's actually doing the aiming. The left stick is just doing the running and the sprinting. I don't find that's actually essential to being aiming. So I just have that with a small control freak or FPS freak. I just have the small one on that one because it's not actually important to aiming. And I just don't want there to be a huge size difference. So uh, the left stick is really not important. The right one is the crucial one here that we want to improve. So the more leverage on that, the higher the stick is, the better you're going to aim. Now, in terms of cons I really can't think of any it's hard to think of disadvantages to a product that only costs ten dollars and you get two of them so uh, it, essentially you could probably use them on two different controllers because as I said the left stick is really not that important to use so uh, they only cost ten dollars and uh, to be honest there aren't really any cons I would say that a con I guess would be that uh, if you don't use them then it'll feel very weird so if you go to a friend's house or if you play a competition with other controllers that don't have these uh, FPS freaks on them then that'll feel kind of weird so that kind of suggests that you can't really play without them once you get used to them and your aim will feel very very much off because these allow you to uh, aim very very accurately so uh, I guess that's a con I guess it's a good thing it means you can't play without them so uh, but they're small you can just chuck them in a bag or your pocket or whatever and carry them around if you think you want to play some games when you're out and uh, so they're very very inexpensive as I said only ten dollars and uh, you can click the link in the description where you can buy them on their the control freak website and uh, so they have two different shapes and two different heights uh, the concave 
concave ones are they have the dip in the center kind of like the xbox thumbsticks and then there are the domed ones which are similar to the playstation thumbsticks and they they all work with all controllers so you don't have to worry if you if you have a playstation controller and maybe you want to have an xbox type uh, thumbstick then you could throw that on if you like and, uh, and then they have two different heights which are the large ones and the small ones you've seen uh, i like to have the small one on the left stick and the larger one on the right stick because uh, obviously the aiming on the right stick is more important and uh, yeah so that is the control freaks well i guess control freaks is the name of the company and fps freaks are the name of the products they also have things like arcade freaks and their uh, speed freaks which help your uh, thumb not slip off if you're playing racing games and uh, they have arcade games and sport games you can check all those out but i'm focusing on the fps freak because obviously i'm an fps channel and i want to help you guys out with uh, improving your aim so i also might be doing a giveaway of these uh, sometime soon because they asked me if i wanted to do one and uh, who doesn't like free stuff so uh, definitely keep a lookout for uh, that on my channel it will probably be happening at some time in the next couple of weeks and uh, yes yeah, so the site is in the description where you can find it you can also get 10% off if you use the word unknown at, uh, at the checkout because I got myself a little uh, discount code for you guys to use so if you use the word unknown at uh, checkout you can get 10% off so that makes $10 into 9 it's just that simple it's not a huge discount but there you go I uh, hope you guys have enjoyed this video I hope you found it helpful and informative as an honest review and uh, as I say you'd like to uh, check out their products products it will be in the description other than that i hope you enjoyed the video you can leave a like on it if you have enjoyed it and i'll see you guys later Jump.